What's up guys? It is Saturday, snuck away to the office because I had this video on my mind about um, how we're changing up the way that we're managing projects at the shop. Unfortunately, I am kind of reluctantly giving up my board and I'm showing you what I'm doing instead. Also, I have taken down all of the menu boards that were in the front. You can see I have them all kind of piled up right here. And I'll tell you why. I'm not getting rid of the project board for the sake of project management. I'm getting rid of the project board for the sake of the front end finances of the business. It's too hard using the menu boards to quote projects. It's not too hard for me, but I take for granted the amount of experience I have in the industry possibly. Um, but I'm trying to make it so that there's no reason for the front office staff to have to make calculations of any kind to make it super simple. No reason to add 20% for bleed and trim. No reason to add 25% to go from a five and a half by eight and a half booklet to a eight and a half by 11 booklet. No reason to add 25% for a double sided print versus a single sided print. Things like that. I'm trying to make it super simple and super easy. And uh, QuickBooks really does not allow for that to happen. So we're changing from QuickBooks um, to Shopbox. Uh, and I'll show you why um, in a second. In QuickBooks, what I would traditionally do, I tracked four categories. Um, I would track uh, signs, I would track paper printing, I would track promotional products, and I would track apparel slash screen printing. Um, that's why I have four different colored cards up there. Um, and that's the way we kind of track things. I would put in a product, a sign for instance, but then I would just custom type in the stuff, calculate stuff from the top of my head, or I'd look at the price menu and I'd just calculate it up. It's easy for me to do, but it's not easy for everybody. And I'm trying to make it simple. I got a little microphone set up here. I'm going to show you on the screen what I'm talking about. So here is the opening screen of Shopbox. You can see that we have quick access to an overview glimpse of quotes, an overview of sales orders, an overview of invoices, and also jobs. And the jobs really gives you a, a great breakdown. So you can see um, where the vast majority of projects are in the process. And you can see it, it really kind of mirrors up with what we have on our project board. And I'll show you that in a second. But for now, I want to show you how easy it is to set up uh, product pricing for every single type of product. I'm talking signs, paper printing, promotional products, and for screen printing. When you go to banners, uh, we're able to select um, how much we want to upcharge for a double-sided banner. We're able to enter in the different types of material that we want to use, uh, different brands even. 13-ounce gloss material, for instance, we can say is our cost is 25 cents a square foot. Um, and so our price per square foot is $4. So you can see what the markup is. It's really a uh, feature rich uh, for that. Um, let's go back to paper printing. Uh, brochures, for instance, we, we could set up a quantity matrix along with the different types of sizes. And what I really like is the fact that we have income accounts um, and cost of good accounts that match up exactly with what we have inside of QuickBooks because we are 100% tied in with our QuickBooks. So in terms of accounting, I'm able to keep my profit and loss statement uh, and my chart of accounts exactly the way I want to, but I don't have to manage the business from QuickBooks, which is really not what it's meant to do. We're also able to tie in with catalogs for our screen printing purposes, Sanmar, SS Activewear, Alpha Broder, all those we are tied into. And what I love about this is Shopbox is costing us $100 a month plus $20 per user. We were paying Printavo 
$400 a month. And all Printavo is really good at is screen printing and apparel. So Shopbox is able to do that and so much more. Also, Sage, the, our promotional products gateway is tied in as well. And so I'll show you that um, when we go to do some quoting here. So let's get that going. So if we go to customers and type in Inspire, this is our advertising agency. And let's just go to create a quote. So choose our sales tax. We're gonna add a banner. All right, banner we'll just say is 48 by 96, 13 ounce gloss material, 24 inch spacing on the grommets, taped, save this line item, bam, $128. Okay, let's add design to this. So we have come up with a bunch of design packages that are specific to each product type because we're trying to make this easy for our customer service people that we put in place here. So a banner, a standard five day turnaround, save this line item, 30 bucks. There we go. Let's say we also want brochures quoted. All right, brochure, quantity of 100, 80 pound gloss text, eight and a half by 11. Save this line item. Let's say we want to quote a shirt. So we'll say apparel, screen printing, SS activewear. We'll do a Gildan 8000, dark heather. All right, we're gonna add a location A full front, one color. Save. All right, we'll say 10 of those, 10 of these, 10 of these, 10 of these. All right. Save this line item. Perfect. Let's say a promotional product. Okay, you could do a custom product. Let's say you're doing USB drives in house or something. You want to set that up, fine. Or if you want to enter a Sage item number, you go to an advanced search here. Just put in the item number for Sage. Let me grab one. All right, search product. There it is. We're going to select this item. And we're able to select black, uh, the quantity that we want to order, let's say 500, $2.70 is our cost. Um, the client's cost is $4.49. And this is what the markup is. Save this line on them. It already has the setup fees for everything. And bam, it is <laughs> so easy to quote all of these different things. I absolutely love it. Next, let me show you what the job management functionality looks like. All right, so if we go to manage jobs, this right here is a digital reproduction of our physical cork board that we have in the shop. Uh, we have all the same categories that we had set up before and um, we're able to get just a nice view of all the different products and uh, jobs that are happening. And it's really, really neat. Um, you could see we also have things tagged. So it's either paper printing, um, flatbed printing, screen printing, um, roll to roll, 
Um, let's see, this one right here doesn't have a tag, but this is a response card. So this is paper printing. So I'm just going to tag that real quick. Um, you can see, let's see, if you want to drag this to a certain area, we can. This was actually installed. So I'm going to click on this. Um, it's done. This project is totally complete. So I am going to make this completed. And now it's gone. Um, let's see. What else can I show you? Um, I really love the functionality of um, proofing. Um, you're able to email a proof to a client and the client is able to go in and uh, click the proof for approval. It really just keeps everybody informed and everybody on the same page in the office. So I don't know, this is a, a big change for us, but I think it's gonna be really good for our business. I'm gonna be honest, I still like this better. I like it better, I really do. But on the other hand, I do want this business to be able to run without me. Um, I do want to expand this business one day. I'd like to have multiple locations and it's gonna be really hard to run a business uh, from multiple locations using one cork board. And the reality is I'm gonna have to make some changes to invest in technologies to manage this kind of stuff. I hope it works. I've done this before. I have a lot of experience with this type of software and uh, you have to have buy-in from every single member of your team or it just doesn't work. And so we're having to do this and it kind of sucks in ways because we like our system the way it was. So we'll see how it goes. Maybe it'll be a massive failure. If it is, I'll let you know. But this is how we're managing products now, projects now here at Mr. Postman. Thank you guys for tuning in and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.